Maddox, first time drifting like this. Woo! That G force the front. Real the front. <laughs> Woo! What's up everyone? We're here today to check out Alex and his 180SX. This SR20 powered SX is equipped with JE pistons, Tomai connecting rods and a Tomai head gasket. The Mazook's head studs and rod bolts help hold things together under all the abuse of drifting. Split fire coils help keep this engine energized as an excessive intake feeds a consistent flow of boost to this hungry SR20 motor. Big Papi Racing put together this build and it's no surprise that it performs well, as we have seen many builds on the channel. Good job again, Big Papi Racing. The new G-Series Garrett G30 770 horsepower rated turbo is fed by a dull-built exhaust manifold and a custom dull built 3 inch exhaust system playing music through the Kakimoto barrel at the back. When under boost, the thirst is quenched by a custom fuel system built and installed by Terence Otto. The Haltech 550 Elite controls all the lovely mechanicals and gadgets associated with this motor. The mastermind of John Mark tuned the ignition, timing and fuel. All this work done produces a conservative 400 wheel horsepower on pump gas, which is more than enough to slip and slide around any drifting course. R34 brakes in front and R33 brakes at the rear is planted by CX Racing coilovers, which feeds a Cusco two-way LSD, assisted by the driftwork arms. Sounds like a lot, doesn't it? Let's not get y'all overwhelmed by too much info and get back to the action. So, let's see if this drift built machine can go fast in a straight line as we took it out for a test on the draggy. It's obvious the car will do low 12s as we suffered for traction basically the whole of first and second gear. The purpose of this machine was one thing and it was a bonus being able to deal with people on a straightaway as well. 